Hello. Welcome to the Master the Art of Flutter series. A step-by-step -step tutorial for beginners. Continuous integration and deployment. In this video, we will delve into the details of setting up a robust CI-CD pipeline for Flutter apps and effectively deploying them to production. This video focuses on streamlining the development, testing, and deployment processes of Flutter applications to ensure a seamless workflow. Setting up a CI-CD pipeline for Flutter apps. The first topic covered in this chapter is setting up a CI-CD pipeline for Flutter apps. Continuous integration involves merging code changes from multiple developers into a shared repository and automatically building and testing the application. Continuous deployment is the process of automatically deploying the application to a production environment after it passes the necessary tests. To achieve this, developers can leverage popular CI-CD platforms like Jenkins, Travis CI, or GitHub Actions. These platforms provide a range of tools and processes, including code compilation, running tests, generating build artifacts, and deploying the app to app stores or other distribution channels. Let's take a look at setting up a basic CI-CD pipeline using GitHub Actions. Here is an example configuration file. In this example, whenever code is pushed to the main branch, the CI-CD pipeline runs on an Ubuntu environment. It checks out the code, sets up Flutter, installs dependencies, and runs tests using the Flutter test command. This configuration can be customized based on specific project requirements. Deploying Flutter Apps to Production The second topic covered is deploying Flutter Apps to Production. Once the CI pipeline is set up and the tests pass successfully, it's time to deploy the app to a production environment where users can access it. Flutter provides several options for deploying apps, including app stores like Google Play Store and Apple App Store, as well as web deployment and deployment to other platforms like desktop and embedded devices. Let's take the example of deploying a Flutter app to the Google Play Store. The following steps need to be followed. 1. Generate an Android app bundle, AAB, or an APK using the Flutter build command. The AAB format is recommended as it allows Google Play to optimize the app for different devices. 2. Create a developer account and set up a Google Play console, which serves as the central hub for managing and distributing your app. 3. Create a new app listing in the Google Play console, providing all the necessary information such as the app name, description, screenshots, etc. 4. Upload the generated AAB or APK to the Google Play console and configure other release-related settings, such as release tracks, rollout percentages, and targeting specific device configurations. 5. Submit the app for review, ensuring that it complies with the Google Play policies and guidelines. Once approved, the app will be available for users to download and install from the Google Play Store. Similar processes and guidelines apply to deploying Flutter apps to the Apple App Store or other platforms. Each platform may have its specific requirements and review processes. Conclusion Continuous integration and deployment aim to automate the build, testing, and deployment processes of Flutter apps, ultimately increasing efficiency, reducing errors, and ensuring a faster time to market. By setting up a robust CI-CD pipeline and following the platform-specific deployment guidelines, developers can streamline their workflows and deliver high-quality Flutter apps to users. All right, Flutter explorers. We've just built a rocket ship for our apps. We unlocked the secrets of continuous integration and deployment, ensuring your masterpieces blast off seamlessly from development to users' devices. No more manual pushes, no more launch day jitters, just smooth, automated flight. Hit that like and subscribe button, in the next chapter, we'll dive into the world of testing and quality assurance, making sure your app flies high with confidence. Keep fluttering, and remember, a smooth launch is just the beginning, let's build apps that stay strong and stable in the sky.